Hi there, welcome back to the Smart Receipts video series. In this one, we're going to show you how to generate a report, which will make your life a lot easier when you don't have to compile all these receipts together and tape them to a piece of paper in Xerox or however you've done it before. So as you can see from before, we had our previous lunch receipt and we've gone ahead and created a few new ones in this report. And now we're ready to generate a report. Um, the way you do that is by clicking here over on the Generate tab or by swiping left or right twice over to the Generate tab. And it gives you a few different options. There's a full page PDF report, which will create a PDF report that also has a number of tables and information at the top. There is a PDF report that only has the images and no tables. There's a CSV report, which has it's basically an Excel file, so you can import that into Excel. And you can get a zip report with all your files, or you can get a zip report, but some of them have stamped information, um, like the name and price tied to the image. Additionally, you're free to customize how these reports get generated. So you can either customize the PDF report and affect what all the columns are that you can see and what shows up in the actual table at the top. Uh, same for the CSV report, which again is the Excel one, and a variety of other things. So in this case, we're just going to create a PDF and a CSV report. Oops. PDF and CSV report, and we're going to click Build. And this will create them both for us. So rather than sharing these two items, I'm going to go uh, show an example of the report. So here's the one we've generated before. This is the PDF table at the top, and here are our receipts and such below. So that's kind of, I'd recommend experimenting it with yourself and uh, see which reports work best for you and for your business and take it from there. So thank you for listening, and that's the end of this video.